347, 348, 349, 350. Ha ha ha! Ah, this old dog's breaking even his old records. 351, 352, 353, 400. Oh, yes. Oh, nice catch, Ground. Oh, what a fine day. What a fine day to be walking through the orchard. Oh, yes. Oh, hello there. My name is Sebastian Eugene Bartholomew. Fantastic scientist. Amazing researcher. All around good guy. Mm -hmm. Give or take. Things seem to be bright and cheery in the orchard this morning, and uh, I'm also bright and cheery despite my cool, calm exterior. In fact, uh, I uh, have developed a new addition to my fighter poetry book, and you're just in time to hear me recite it. Are you ready? Steal your ears. This one is entitled Guts Like Guacamole. Carrots and potatoes and broccoli, too, can sometimes come down with the vegetable flu. Leaves turn colors and start to look sickly while fungi grow and bacteria driply. If plants don't outgrow it, you will surely know it, and all of your dreams of salsa and beans will end up like compost in the end. Strawberries and apples, and cherries, too, sometimes are consumed by an insect pest brood. Leaves are devoured and start to look holy by caterpillars with guts that look like guacamole. These bugs will munch on what you grow for lunch on, and all of your dreams of sweet nectarines will end up like frass in the end. Hackberry and maple and tulip trees too may have a hard time in a front yard plant zoo. Saturated with salt from a nearby road, with trunks that get cut every time grass is mowed. Plant trees rightly to keep leaves green and sprightly, or all of your hopes for healthy old oaks will end up like sawdust in the end. Thank you, thank you. For real, behind this mustache, I'm an extension worker. The job of extension workers is to bring information to people who can use it, and that includes information on pest management, disease management, disorders in front yards, gardens, greenhouses. Check out the links for descriptions on resources that you can use to uh, diagnose some of the stuff that you may find that's eating your plants. Sebastian Eugene Bartholomew has been perfecting a technique for making guacamole. It's going to be trademarked. Are you ready to see this? I knew you'd be. Where's the tortilla chips?